Hey Aquarius, this is your reading for October 2020, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. Let's go ahead and jump in. Second time I've seen that Ace of Pentacles come out for you in the Chariot card. Okay, Moving towards new possibilities. We're going to see what's going on with you here, Aquarius. Okay, What is Aquarius preparing themselves for in love in October? Okay, Abundance, possibly. Moving towards that. Moving towards freedom. Um... When it comes to yourself here, okay? Or oh, they're saying freedom brings romance to you. <laughs> okay, since we're talking about love, you freeing yourself brings romance. Let's see what's going on here. They want you to know you have options. Here you have the seven of um, wands come in. Seven of Wands. Okay. Interesting. You have the third eye chakra. You have the throat chakra. Okay. You have the five of cups. You have the two of swords here. <laughs> They're saying you can see through somebody here. Okay. Uh, see through this person, really. I need to speak up for yourself. Um, make a move here. You have the two of pentacles moving in. So the throat chakra and choices. Maybe you, you feel like, um, you're trying to really get to know someone with this throat chakra and the two of pentacles, um, moving in here. Some of you guys are at a crossroads in a relationship and a choice will be made. I feel like you're voicing yourself right now, possibly voicing how you feel, uh, voicing that you may not agree with something in, a, in the connection or agree with someone and how they're treating you, um, what they're giving to you, how your needs are being met here uh, with the two of pentacles coming out. Mm. <laughs> I'm going to take a look at this. I'm going to do this reading a little different. Speaking up for yourself. Look at that. Ace of Pentacles coming out again. Okay. And you have a letter. So either you're sending a message to someone. I feel like you're sending a message to someone. That's what it is here. About how you feel and you possibly needing to free yourself from a situation. Um, goodness, it feels like you're moving on. I didn't want to say that, but it feels like you're moving on. That's what it is here. You're moving on because you're dealing with someone, uh, else here. Okay. You're dealing with someone that is closed off. Their emotions are closed off with the two of swords coming in here. It feels almost like this person, I will say it is. A stalemate and even though you're having um difficulties releasing this person you know you want love okay i feel like you are offering love to this person but is being rejected um they're closed off mentally towards it here um your third eye chakra is coming in here they're saying uh use your intuition in regards to this connection here okay or trust in, in what you feel with this third eye chakra coming in here. You also have some intuitive guidance uh, helping you along here. I feel like it, it's all pointing towards new love, new possibilities, new avenues of good fortune and security and balance in your life. It's not surrounding anything that's old or anything that you feel uh, you need to release yourself from. They're telling you to stand your ground with this seven of wands coming in here and you have the five of cups here. So a love has lost you or you've lost a love here. Eight, nine, ten. You have the ten of wands. There's too much struggle to deal with either way here. Okay. Uh, you had a situation here. 
uh, that was emotionally unbalanced or mentally unbalanced here, okay? Um, and some of my Aquarius out there, you're feeling ground down by a relationship you had in the past or someone that you're dealing with now. I don't know exactly where you are in your journey here. Uh, but it feels with this combination, the Ten of Wands and the Five of Cups, that you're doing all the heavy lifting in the relationship or that you guys may feel like someone took advantage of you or they're taking advantage of you here, okay? And some of you guys are feeling totally exhausted with this connection. Um, I feel like the guys are saying here, okay? Your guys are saying, stand up for yourself. Speak up for yourself. Put your foot down, okay? Um, someone is more trouble in the end uh they're more trouble in your life than they need to be okay they're saying take a, a step back and breathe and really look at whether or not you want to uh stay in a connection or release yourself from it here because it's too much baggage you're holding on to too much and this person may not even be worth you holding on to okay, okay. they're taking you on another path here that's what i'm saying Let's take a look at this person's intentions. What are they doing to you here, Aquarius? And cards here for Aquarius. What is the intentions of this person Aquarius is dealing with? God, they just got a lot of confusion. I'm seeing the Eight of Swords and actually that's the Ten of Swords. It's even worse. Okay, Ten of Swords. They may be doing things intentionally because they want an ending to a relationship. Either way, I feel like this obstacle is being removed out of your way right now. Okay, and you're being told to take care of yourself. Yes. That's what they're doing. They may have someone else in mind, someone else in their heart. Got the Five of Cups moving in here. Their intentions, okay? I don't feel like this is a new person. I feel like this is someone you've dealt with or you're dealing with here, okay? Their intentions is not to stick around. I see them leaving because they're unhappy or they're dissatisfied. This could be both of your energies. You're not getting your needs met right now at this time here. And someone's not putting you as a priority with the Queen of Cups here. And that there is a decision that's going to be made here. That's what I'm saying. Um, it feels almost with the Two of Wands there that someone it has unrealistic expectations of you. Um, they may be a bit controlling or have control issues as well i definitely feel here aquarius that this is too much stress for you or you're feeling exhausted from this imbalance that you're experiencing with this person let's get all your cards out here and see what they have to say and get any advice out the spirit house for you. Okay, yeah. Definitely. They're pointing you in a new direction. That's your advice here. Your person is saying, my heart is just telling me. My heart is telling me, just do it. Just do what? Walk away from a connection, let it go because they're not happy. Um, they have the Eight of Cups, their intentions, okay? And their heart is telling them to move on. Here, you have someone that is controlling. <laughs> There's a word right there, controlling. They have blocks, restraints, okay? They may be obsessive, possessive, uh, codependent in some way, and they want you to be the way that they need you to be so they feel fulfilled in some way, okay? Okay. They're saying, please don't take what happened personally. It's not you, it's me here, okay? Um, I still see them moving on. The word is on here, okay? Moving on, happily single, having fun, living in the moment. That's how they want to be. This is also a message to you here, Aquarius, okay? Maybe you are confiding in friends, Um 
to get your self-esteem back up, to see uh, your worth, to, to feel worthy again, okay? Because this person has some type of hold on you and may make you feel like you're not good enough for them, okay? So you may be confiding with friends or you may be spending time with family, friends or other people uh, that give you good vibes and good energy and I feel like they are nurturing you, taking care of you, letting you know um, that it's okay for you to possibly move on from a situation here, okay? Make better choices. Your message here is to make healthy choices here, okay? Making healthy choices in love and in life, self-love, self-care, being happier. And that's what you need to do with that um, Queen of Pentacles here. Okay, make sure that you're good, make sure that you're okay, and make sure you don't have someone that is codependent and relies on you, okay? Your person is saying it's easier to just stay away right now. It's easier to try to avoid you, try to avoid conversations. Um, it's easier to just play the role right now instead of really putting in hard work. Someone is very stubborn and insecure in themselves, and they're trying to pass that off on you. Your guides are letting you know that you make you need to make healthier choices right now at this moment. There's a, a need for you to make a decision. Some of you guys are releasing yourself, okay? Your person wants you to know I'm more affected than you know. Mm. They're trying to let you know that they're heartbroken. <laughs> or you being hurt affects them more than you know. But they're not happy in the connection. I feel like they're not happy. Okay. Sabotage. <clears throat> Intentional sabotage. You trying to rebuild yourself. Uh, persistent. Being persistent. Working on yourself. These are the things that uh, I feel that's a message to you here, Aquarius. To continue to work on yourself. To be persistent and build yourself back up. And release yourself from something that may be making you unhappy. This person knows you're unhappy here okay let's take a look at the outcome or any messages spirit has for you and the cards here for Aquarius cards for Aquarius temperance go through that healing here Aquarius and release yourself from toxicity <laughs> that's what I'm saying bringing balance to your mind your body and your spirit right now okay take a break on this person to work on yourself or gain a new perspective on how you're going to move forward in your life okay um don't try to fight and hold on to a connection um if some of you guys are doing that the message is to move on to take care of self to love yourself self-love self-care to be happier here okay um and the hangman is definitely letting me know that you uh need to let go possibly of any attempt to control the outcome they're saying in letting go you win okay um and surrendering you survive okay this is a delicate time and you need to take care of yourself and make healthier choices for you right now all right all right, Aquarius, that is your reading. I love you guys, okay? Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell because I will be back with you. Take care of yourself, Aquarius. I love you guys. Bye.